In this video, we'll be guiding you on how to quickly set up the Reolink Duo 2 PoE and install it yourself. Before the setup, make sure you have the following items. Also, make sure your phone is updated to the latest version of the Reolink app. To power on your camera, first, connect it to the PoE port of the PoE switch using an Ethernet cable. Then connect the PoE switch to your router with another Ethernet cable. The next step, add your camera to the Reolink app. You have two options, add the camera automatically or add it manually. To add your camera automatically, you need to make sure your phone is connected to the same network as the camera, and the Add Device Automatically option is enabled. Then you'll see your device on the screen. You can just tap it to enter the initialization page. If you choose to add the camera manually, tap the Add Device button and scan the QR code on the camera. You can also tap Enter to type in the UID number or IP address of the camera, or tap LAN to scan all the devices within the LAN and add your camera from the device list. Note that to scan the devices in LAN, you also need to connect your phone and camera to the same network. Lastly, initialize the camera. Create a login password and name your camera. To install the Reolink Duo 2 PoE yourself, first, check if you have the following items. Screws, drill, a screwdriver, the camera bracket, the mounting plate, mounting hole template. Then you can choose to mount it on the wall or on the ceiling. Some installation tips for you. To better detect threats, please mount the camera two to three meters above the ground and in the direction crossing the direction of intruders. To ensure image quality, avoid pointing the camera to direct sunlight, mirrors, or glass windows. To install the camera on the wall, first, you need to attach the mount to the camera body. Next, put the mounting hole template on the wall and drill holes as shown. Then, screw in the mounting plate with two screws on the top holes. Hang the camera mount to the plate and install the third screw into the bottom hole to secure the camera. Lastly, if you want to adjust the viewing angle, you could loosen the adjustment screw on the joint and turn the camera. To install the camera on the ceiling, the first step is to screw the mount to the top of the camera body, and then put the mounting hole template on the ceiling and drill holes. Screw in two screws provided into the back two holes to secure the mounting plate to the ceiling. Then, hang the camera mount to the plate and install the third screw. Lastly, if you want to adjust the viewing angle, you could loosen the adjustment screw on the joint and turn the camera. To ensure a long-lasting performance of the camera, you can install the waterproof lid provided to cover the Ethernet cable connector and prevent water intrusion. That's all for today's video. Any questions about the setup and installation, don't hesitate to tell us in the comments or contact our support team.